Burned County teenager dies in a car accident on the last day of the school year. To make matters worse, police tell Nine on Your Side a 15-year-old was driving and crashed, killing his passenger. This is the area here on Springboro Road near Red Lion Five Points Road. Nine on Your Side's Ashley Zilka is live in Clear Creek Township right now with more on the investigation and reaction from the victim's friends. Craig, pieces of the car are still scattered all along this road. Police say the driver was so young, did not even have a license. His passenger, a 17-year-old, died at the scene. We just finished school yesterday, and uh, here this happens the next day. And this isn't how life is supposed to be. Noah Tice finished up his junior year at Bishop Fenwick High School just hours before a car accident that ended his life. Today, Principal Andy Barzak opened up the school for students and parents who wanted to pray. They're shocked. Um, it, this is a kind of thing that it's, it's a tragedy. It's just so tragic, it, it jars them. State police say a 15-year-old driver lost control of his car Thursday night on Springboro Road in Clear Creek Township. Ran off the road. Um, it struck a utility pole and then overturned a couple of times. Police say that driver was speeding. When he turns 15 and a half, he could have a permit. I do not know if he had one, but obviously if you do have a permit, you still have to be with a parent. Police say Tice was not wearing a seatbelt. The driver and a 16-year-old who was in the back seat were taken to area hospitals but have since been released. Gabe Hole says he just saw his friend Noah last week. He was just a fun, outgoing person. Like He never saw anything negative. He was always a fun person that was positive about everything and he'd do anything for his friends. God has a plan and shows mercy to all of us and uh, we have to. It's not for us to always know, but we have to follow that plan. Although police has not released any official information at this time, they say the driver is looking at several charges, including vehicular homicide. Reporting live, Ashley Zolka, not on your side.